set a goal for yourself in going into 2022? Yeah, uh, I want to be All-Pro, and I want to win Defensive Player of the Year. So that's just my two goals right now. How are you? What are your What are your standards to make sure you accomplish those two things? Everything I can, just keep in a position to make plays, and when they come, just make them. How's that slot been for you? You've been in that position a lot the last three days. Oh uh, yeah, it's good. I like it. I like it. I'm closer to the ball, so I like it. A lot of guys say I've got personal goals, but I'll keep them to myself. What is it about uh, you that makes you willing to tell us what your personal goals are? Um, I mean, they're my goals, and I don't mind expressing them, what they are. I don't think my goals don't help the team, you know what I'm saying? So I think it's cool to express it. My goals only help the team, so. Do Does that like, put pressure on you, though, then, to, to, to back it up when you once you tell someone? Is it one thing to tell yourself a goal? Is it another thing to tell us? I mean, you got to keep telling yourself, and you got to put it out there in the world so that it happens, you know? And there's no pressure. If I, if I fall short, I fall short. But I know that's the goal, and that's what I'm going to do. Do you think that this could be the best defense that you've ever played on? Oh, for sure. We definitely have the chance. We, we still got to prove it, but we definitely have the chance. What about this defense makes you think it's going to be the best one you've played with? Um, we all sacrifice anything to win. We all do whatever it takes, whether that's meetings, extra on the field. And you look out there now, guys are still on the field 45 minutes after practice. Like, we're just all in right now. What's that like to be part of a team that just gives it every day, 110%? That's good, because I know, like, I trust him. And I know he'll do whatever to make sure I'm good, and I'll do whatever. And then we got that accountability on each hand. Like, you're supposed to do your job, do it. I'm supposed to do my job, I got to do it. How does it feel to be able to come back here? I know the cap constraints that the te this team faced, but they were able to get you back. Like, how does it feel to be able to, to try to finish the unfinished business from last year? Uh, good. I think all of us were sad uh, due to last year. I mean, we thought we should have been holding the trophy and we didn't. So it's good to come back and now finally put those work in to, to do what we're supposed to do. When you came here last year, I don't want to like, put words in your mouth or anything, but I would imagine you had to prove yourself a lot now mm -hmm. that you did yourself last year is your mindset still the same or what's the mindset going into year two in Greenwood? Uh, same thing coach told us the other day he said whatever you did last year don't matter no one cares about it it's wiped out and now you gotta start a new slate so now I'm coming in different position still gotta prove myself I still gotta gain that trust from my teammates that they like me in a slot and like me to do all that type of work so right now that's what I'm trying to do I'm trying to build my teammates trust so did Philly or Carolina did they play you inside at all at those spots or you won't say perimeter uh, a few times, just depending on what was going on, and some calls uh, determined us to be in a slot. Just like last year, some calls allowed me to be in a slot. Sure. How, what, what is that transition like? More inside, how does the game kind of change for you in terms of what, what you're looking for? Uh, you got to tackle more, um, and then things happen faster. But you're always around the ball, so it's a good thing. There's always Seems like you. Sure. There's always that debate amongst the league: who's the best cornerback? Is it Jair? Is it Jalen? You make your case for Alexander as why he is the best cornerback in the league. You see him every day. I mean, the stats proved it, so that, that's why. Is there someone on this defense that you think maybe is not getting enough attention that you think can be a standout this year? One, two, three guys, I don't know. No, nah, I, think every, I think everyone knows everyone here. You can play if you even look at D-Long and P, KC, Reed, RG. I mean, those guys are all names, Moonpaw, all pro. I mean, you look at the back end. We didn't all play last year, so 